The most interesting part about the M5 Mac Mini 2025 isn't just what Apple is building, but what it represents in the larger computing world. When you look at what the competition is doing, it becomes clear that Apple is setting the pace for the next era of desktop performance. Rivals like Intel, AMD, and even Microsoft are trying to close the gap, but Apple's vertical integration gives it an edge that's hard to replicate. Everything from the chip to the operating system to the smallest power optimization works together under one roof. That's the kind of efficiency other manufacturers can only dream of. Compare it to Intel's latest NUC systems, for example. Those small form factor PCs are powerful, sure, but they rely on multiple third-party components and software layers. That means more complexity, more heat, and less efficiency. The M5 Mac Mini, in contrast, is a unified system. Its 3 nanometer chip is purpose-built to handle Mac OS efficiently. The operating system knows exactly how to distribute workloads across CPU, GPU, and AI cores. It's like every part of the system speaks the same language. And that harmony translates into real-world performance. Even when compared with AMD's compact Ryzen desktops, Apple stands out. AMD chips are known for raw, multi-core performance, but they often need large cooling systems and draw far more power. The M5 Mac Mini achieves high performance while staying whisper quiet. That matters not only for comfort, but also for sustainability. Lower heat means longer component life, and lower power draw means less environmental impact over time. Apple's focus on energy efficiency is as much about performance as it is about responsibility. When it comes to professional workstations, Apple's approach is becoming disruptive. Traditional high-end PCs often focus on raw horsepower. You get bigger GPUs, more fans, and bulkier cases. Apple, however, is redefining what Pro means in 2025. It's not just about throwing hardware at a problem anymore. It's about intelligent performance, knowing when to use every watt of energy, when to activate AI acceleration, and when to let the system manage itself quietly in the background. The M5 Mac Mini demonstrates that power doesn't always need to come with size or noise. Now think about real-world use cases. For video creators, this machine could be revolutionary. Editing an 8K project or working on color-graded footage requires more than speed. It requires stability. The M5 architecture handles this by balancing thermal performance and processing strength. Even when timelines get heavy, users won't experience throttling or lag. The upgraded GPU ensures smooth playback and rendering, even when working with high-resolution assets. And since the device is compact, it's easy to carry between studios or connect to any external display setup. For developers, the benefits are equally clear. Compiling large projects, running virtual environments, or training AI models often push traditional desktops to their limits. The M5 chip's AI cores are built specifically to accelerate such workloads. With built-in neural engines and high-bandwidth memory, machine learning models can train locally, without sending sensitive data to the cloud. That not only saves time, but enhances privacy, something Apple users have come to expect. And speaking of privacy, it's becoming one of Apple's strongest selling points. The M5 Mac Mini 2025 takes this further with new security layers integrated directly into the chip. Tasks like facial recognition, encryption, or biometric authentication all happen on device. Nothing leaves the system unless the user allows it. That's part of Apple's long-term strategy, a computing experience that is both intelligent and private. The idea is simple. The more capable your computer becomes, the more it should protect you. But let's step back and think about what all of this means for the average user. Someone who isn't a professional video editor or a scientist? What difference will they actually feel? The answer lies in responsiveness. Everyday actions like launching apps, switching between windows, or even browsing the web feel instant. Background processes like syncing photos, updating files, or managing smart devices happen quietly, powered by on-device AI. The system learns patterns and adapts, like preloading the tools you use most, or adjusting system resources automatically based on your habits. It's the kind of subtle intelligence that makes using a computer feel natural. Apple's approach to ecosystem integration also deserves attention. The M5 Mac Mini isn't meant to exist alone. It's designed to be part of a connected world of Apple devices. Imagine starting an editing session on your iPad, then instantly transferring the project to your Mac Mini to finish it with higher processing power. Or receiving a phone call on your iPhone and answering it through your desktop setup without missing a beat. This seamless continuity has always been a strength of Apple's ecosystem, but the M5's AI foundation makes it even smoother. It can anticipate your needs and suggest transitions between devices before you even think about them.
Gaming is another area where this generation could surprise people. Apple has been investing heavily in Metal 3, its graphics framework, which is now tuned for the M5 chip. This means games that once struggled to run smoothly on macOS are finally achieving stable frame rates and high visual fidelity. Developers can take advantage of features like variable refresh rate and adaptive shading directly at the hardware level. The Mac Mini might not replace dedicated gaming PCs overnight, but it's getting closer than ever before. Combine that with Apple Arcade's expanding catalog and the support for popular third-party engines, and you have a platform that's quietly becoming a real option for gamers who also need professional computing power in one device. For designers and artists, the improvements in AI-based tools could redefine creativity. The M5 chip's neural engines can now handle real-time style transfer, object isolation, and smart layer adjustments within creative software. That means tools like Photoshop or Final Cut Pro become faster, smarter, and less reliant on cloud rendering. Even tasks like 3D modeling or AR design can happen locally. The Mac Mini's power density allows professionals to run complex simulations without needing a massive workstation. And here's the interesting part. Apple's shift toward on-device AI will likely influence the entire industry. As more users demand privacy and speed, the trend will move away from cloud-based processing toward local intelligence. The M5 chip is Apple's statement that desktop computing doesn't need to depend on distant servers to feel modern. This decentralization gives users more control, and in the long run, it could change how data, creativity, and computing interact globally. Another major improvement users will notice is in efficiency and thermals. The redesigned chassis of the M5 Mac Mini is said to feature a new aluminum and glass hybrid structure that improves heat dissipation. This allows the chip to run at higher sustained frequencies without the system becoming noisy or hot. Apple's engineering focus here is clear. No one wants a loud desktop anymore. Silence is the new luxury. And in that silence, the M5 performs like a beast. For professionals working long hours in studios or quiet offices, that kind of subtle refinement matters just as much as raw speed. There's also a growing focus on sustainability in Apple's hardware. The M5 Mac Mini reportedly uses recycled aluminum, responsibly sourced rare earth materials, and a new modular design that makes future repair or component swaps easier. Apple has faced criticism in the past for limiting repairability, but this time they seem to be listening. Rumors suggest that RAM and storage modules could be partially upgradable, something longtime Mac fans will appreciate. Combining sustainability with flexibility gives users both peace of mind and future-proof value. When looking at value, Apple seems to be positioning the M5 Mac Mini smartly. Instead of trying to compete purely on price, it's competing on experience. The entry-level price might be higher than some Windows desktops, but the real cost-to-performance ratio is what stands out. Users get software optimizations, stability, and integration that reduce friction over time. For creative professionals, that's a big deal. Less downtime, fewer crashes, and smoother updates. For regular users, it simply means a computer that lasts longer and keeps performing well even after years of use. As Apple moves forward with this new generation, another question emerges. What does this mean for the rest of the Mac lineup? The answer could be significant. The M5 Mac Mini might become the foundation on which future iMacs and MacBooks are built. Its innovations in AI integration, power efficiency, and thermal management could ripple across Apple's entire product ecosystem. This makes the M5 more than just a single desktop launch. It's a blueprint for Apple's next five years of computing. One of the subtle but impactful changes users will feel is in multitasking. Thanks to AI-assisted memory management, switching between heavy applications is now seamless. Imagine editing a video, rendering a 3D model, and running background simulations, all without any lag or system slowdown. That's what Apple's unified memory architecture enables. The system doesn't waste time copying data between different parts of the chip. Everything flows instantly, which makes even complex workflows feel light.